mushrooms? Well, I think the, the main thing that, I, you know, for myself and I think that uh, for anybody is if you want to get culture or natural resources or anything in to be back or to be valorized in the community, uh, you have to make sure people are doing it and seeing it. And so one of the things that I guess my, I've always done, and I think that the tribe is continuing to do great here, is involving the youth. They have the Tribal Youth Initiative, which is a fantastic program. They are working with kids who are doing natural resource jobs all summer long. They're earning money. But more importantly, they're earning uh, a little bit of culture and a little bit of uh, understanding of their environment. So it's great because these kids are planting trees. They're fixing the shoreline to stop erosion. They're learning how to build teepees. But it's really great because it's the youth doing something where their community is benefiting from their activity. And they're, they're taking that in. If you start to do hands-on or, I guess, just something where you're part of it, then you start to own it. And that's where you really start to own anything, be it you know, your community picking up garbage uh, on the weekend. You know, you've done that, that's you, you've made an impact. So I think that's where it comes down to is how anybody can own their community or own their, their history, their culture, their language. Then you really start to see it blossom.